Holy shit, man. Jake has his hands full. Jake is running through the forest with a knife following Lexi, right? He approaches Lexi from behind and it ends up being Luke and he's freaking out. That's nuts. Basically, the majority of the episode revolves around Chucky trying to convince Jake to kill separate individuals. Favorite part of the episode was when they're having the parent-teacher conference and the Lexi's, Lexi's parents are trying to act like she's innocent. They show the video of Jake's dad. Well, not Jake's dad, but Lexi dressed up as Jake's dad, pretending to get electrocuted. And that was, I don't know, something about this show hits differently. There are a lot of good shots in this episode of Chucky just looking maniacal. You know what I mean? Like when the fire is raging in the background and he's just standing there laughing as everything's burning down around him. Next episode, I predict that Jake is once again going to get blamed for the incident, just like he always has been. Lexi may or may not be alive. I hope she is. I mean, this might sound weird, but as much as I dislike her, I was kind of hoping the show would turn her into a likable character. You know, I thought it, what I thought was weird is that her little sister has this obsession with Chucky and she wants the doll like more than anything right but she's only seen him like once yo just let me know what you thought and I'll see you guys next time